Are you a colorist that is looking for the perfect blonde? Or are you a customer that's also looking for the perfect blonde hair? Well, if so, I think I've got something that you might be interested in. If you currently do blondes and use Shade GQ for toning, then you need to take a look at Oligo's Chlor Gloss. What makes it different is it, is, it uses a hybrid technology. So it's part acidic and part alkaline versus Redken Shade GQ that's acidic. There's nothing wrong with Redken Shades as far as, you know, they have been the number one gloss on the market for nearly 40 years or maybe even longer than 40 years. But in the last few years, this Oligo gloss has been taking the country by storm and it's been winning awards almost every year since its inception. Not to mention, it's also won 2024's award for best demi gloss. It is something that you might want to take a look at because what makes it different is, is it, it's going to give you the conditioning benefits of a conditioning color. It's going to allow you to tone in three to 10 minutes, but it's going to do it without any lift. So it's zero lift. There's no alcohol. There's no ammonia, no PPD and no gluten. It's also vegan. And this is what a bottle looks like. Open it up and just smell it. It's got a nice, pleasant fragrance compared to Shade GQ. So while you're at it, take a whiff of your Shade GQ and see what it smells like. I bet you won't be able to do that. Here are the top key points of Oligo Gloss compared to Redken Shade GQ. Hybrid Acid Alkaline Technology. Clear Gloss uses a unique hybrid technology that offers the advantages of both alkaline and acidic hair colors without the drawbacks. It has a gentle acid balance base buffered to an alkaline pH that works synergistically with acidic molecules. This provides unprecedented shine, conditioning, and color longevity with zero lift. Compared to Rake and Shades EQ, Shades is a purely acidic demi-permanent color. It may not provide the same level of versatility and performance as Color gloss does. It also has an alcohol free water base, which helps protect the hair and scalp and keeps moisture inside the hair cortex. The water base makes it gentle and conditioning. Shade GQ, from what I've heard, it has alcohol and a small amount of ammonia, hence the smell that you're smelling with it. Alcohol and hair color can be drying to the hair. If you've been using Redken Shade GQ for a long time, you know, you know the condition of the hair after a week or two maybe even a few days. This is a special kit that they're giving sales reps to hand out to non Oligo Gloss users. The reason why they're giving this out is because they know if you're already using Shade GQ and you like the purest blondes or your customers like a, a nice pearly creamy blonde like you see on this box, it says unleash that AI blonde. You can also do a flash tone with this just like you do Shade GQ, but the difference is this is three to 10 minutes at the bowl and it will tone with pure tones. There's no tan, there's no, no brown in the, in the formula. So when it fades or as it fades gradually, you're still going to have the pure tones. You're still going to have that pure blonde and you're not going to get that with Shade GQ. You know that. And this is what I, what I hear from other Shade GQ users. Now I'm not knocking Shade GQ because it's been around, it's been the number one leader for all these years. But it's time to awaken to the new up and coming winner of the glossing realm. Now, no other company that I've seen has been able to do quite what this company has been able to do. So you need to take a look at it. I know that once you try it, you're going to love it. And they've made an investment. They, they know that when they give this out and you use it, you know, if it sits in your cabinet and does nothing, then it's, you're not going to ever see the results. It mixes equal parts. They have a liquid developer as well as a cream uh, developer. So, you know, if you like working with cream, you can have that uh, benefit. And then if you like working with a, with a more liquid color that you can squeeze through a bottle, then you've got that ability as well. They've also got an intense uh, neutral series that will give you even more gray coverage. People that have switched from Shade GQ to this, they tell me that the, the pigments in this are stronger than Shade GQ. So they're telling me they're not using as much color. They're using more clear. 
but they're getting awesome results and they love using this color. And if you go into the Oligo Professional Facebook group, uh, it's full of stylists that have actually made the switch and uh, they'll tell you what it took to make the switch and what they think about it today. They came out with an amazing lookbook. It just came out today. And if you want a copy of this, all you have to do is go scan this uh, QR code or click on the link in this description. And it's gonna take you to a landing page where you just enter your email address and you're gonna subscribe to their emails and you will get the download link for this lookbook. This is a great tool that can help you sell more color services, more blinding services, because what better than to have something to show your clients and then have the formulas there to get that formula. This is just a little glimpse of as to what you're going to get. Here again, the Chlorogloss has won all of these awards. Again, just to go over the key benefits, it's a demi-permanent liquid hair color, the hydrolyzed vegetable proteins, acai fruit extract and hyaluronic acid are some of the ingredients. It's a hybrid technology, gives you longevity, toning in three to 10 minutes. And again, it's gonna give you that flash toning ability that you're so used to with Shade GQ, but the difference is it's gonna look great for up to 24 washes and, and beyond. It's got a very pleasant fragrance, white blending up to 50%. You also have gloss for men, you also have different mixers and no animal derived ingredients and gluten free. So here's just a sample of 100 plus looks in this 73 page document. And it's just chock full. There's too many to show you right here. So you're going to need to download it yourself and take a look at it. But you can just see all these different beautiful blondes that you can create with Oligo Gloss. Now, if you're not already using their black light lightning system, that's something else. If you end up going with the gloss, you're going to want to uh, start using their black light system because it's a very unique award-winning lightning system where it has four key lighteners that can be used individually or they're designed to be intermixed to create ultimate combinations of blonding. The number one formula is their extra blonde. Uh, they also have their cool tone blonde, and then they have a clay lightener and a cream lightener. Plus, they have their smart developers, and, you know, there's a lot of talk about bond builders out there and bleaches. Well, bond builders don't really live too well in, in ammoniated bleaches. And so Oligo, is, and, and Oligo basically tells us this, these are bond protectors, but they put those in the, in the developer themselves. So their black light smart 10, 20, 30, and 40 volume developers all have bond protectors in them. And those are designed to actually replenish the lost lipids, um, to protect the hair from damage, and to, and to just to help protect the bonds. And so you're going to get hair that's not only gorgeous and beautiful and shiny, but also healthy and conditioned. I decided to swatch out my favorite blonde toner, Calora Glass 10 AI, on a couple blonde wefts. I did a side-by-side -side test using 10 AI and then a level 10 ash iridescent in another leading liquid demi. The processing time for Calora is five, about five minutes, three to 10 technically. I got where I was going in literally five minutes. The other one processed for a full 20 and was still very beigey. I got a lot of cool tone from the 10 AI, which is why it's my go-to. You can see on her natural starting level 10, it was very similar to the extension process for literally five minutes. And I got this cool, iridescent, beautiful platinum blonde. So I love Unleash That AI Blonde. It is a coincidence that our 10-12 or AI stands for Ash Iridescent or a Blue Violet Base is our number one selling shade. 
And I feel like this oh, is the blonde is. everyone is requesting. Mm -hmm. This one is our number one selling. I call it like a creamy, pearly commercial mm -hmm. blonde. So creamy, pearly commercial blonde. It's our number one selling skew. Mm -hmm. And you can even call it the AI blonde because you know, AI is like a big thing right now, right? Yeah. So usually colors that look like this are AI generated, but how would you like to have an AI blonde in real life? This is for you. Redken has brown or tan backing in their colors. So for example, this is a 1012 or 10 AI, which is an ash iridescent or a blue, blue violet. What you see is what you get. We don't have brown as a filler in the background. So you're gonna get the purest tone on the hair. Whereas with Redken, you're still gonna have warm. No brown backing, what you see is what you get. It's nice and pure tone. But more importantly, it's gonna last up to 24 shampoos. Mm -hmm. Ask, straight up ask them, how long does your um, other brand last? They'll tell you it's not gonna last that long. It, like a couple of shampoos sure. comes out of the hair. So let them know it lasts up to 24 shampoos. It's alcohol free. What happens with that color when it fades, like mm. over time? Yes, okay, so here's the thing. Here's my little pitch when I talk to Reckonites. I told them, I do the example of our uh, Dash 1 or A series versus their Ash, because our Dash 1 or A is a blue Ash, ours is 100% blue, whereas in theirs, it's half brown, half blue. So that's why we all know, what does Ash colors do? Cool, cool, down. Cool, cool down. down, but with theirs, they'll still see warmth. So here's something, and I could confidently tell you that if you say this little thing to them, they're gonna agree with you. So do you feel that their ashes could still be a little warm? Every single answer is gonna be yes, because of that brown backing. Ours, what you see is what you get. It's gonna be cool. It's gonna last up to that 24 shampoos, depending on what their salon guests do when they leave us. But with that being said, they're gonna have longer lasting results. It's alcohol free, so it's not gonna dry out the hair. Tony, this is where you're gonna get them as well. How long do you process your toner? They're gonna to say 15 to 20 minutes. What if I was to tell you that I have a toner that the toning processing time is three to 10 minutes and lasts up to 24 shampoos? Is that something you're interested in? What? So it doesn't matter if they leave it on for three minutes, it's still gonna last up to 24 shampoos. What other yeah, brand out there could do that? On for three to four minutes and, that's, and that's the reason why it doesn't last. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly, and then it comes back and we blame, oh, it's your hot tools, which that could have something to do with it. You've been out in the sun, well water, but a lot of times it's just the formulation, uh, the background color that's in there. I don't know, when I teach classes, they tell me that they leave it on for 15 to 20. So, yeah, yeah. And see, and actually, I'm glad that we're talking about this because I've had some people leave caloric gloss on for toners for 15 to 20 minutes. So with that being said, guess what happens if they leave it on for 15 to 20 when they're toning? It over deposits. Three to 10 minutes is all you need for toning. Still lasts up to 24 shampoos. You got also, do you, and I start asking them, what kind of surfaces do you do? Do you do white hair blending? They're gonna say, most people do white hair blending. You could get up to 50% white hair blending. Do you uh, use a demi-permanent to refresh mid links and ends? Yes. Do you um, use a demi-permanent to low light with? Yes. Do you do what I call the double dipped reds? Do you tone like red or leave red on afterwards? Yes, there's so many different ways to utilize gloss besides toning as well. So what do you think? Does it make you want to try this? I can only give these samples out to people in my area from my customers. So if you're watching this and you're not one of my customers or you're, you know, you're, you have a salon outside of my area, contact your local Oligo professional rep. And if you don't know a rep or, or maybe you might be a stylist that, that maybe you're in an area where they don't have a rep, you can always contact the company directly, uh, oligoprofessional.com. They are an amazing company and they, they use high quality, healthy ingredients, as healthy as you can get to do the job. This is worth trying. And I guarantee you, 
You try it, you do it after a uh, lightening or bleaching or a blonding service. Use that to give you that purely icy blonde. You're going to get amazing results. And then after you do that, I want you to contact me. First, take a before picture so you know what you started with and then do an after picture. But contact me and let me know what you think. And for those people that actually try this, we have special savings on intros. And this is for a limited time. So be sure to not waste time and put this you know, aside in your cabinet. This is the problem. You know, a lot of times we'll drop these off to people and you know, they get all excited when we're there, but then guess what? It gets put off to the side. Oh, we're yeah, going to use this on the right person. Well, that right person never comes. And, you know, they, they feel like they're, well, I, I don't want to use just any customer as a guinea pig. Well, this is not a guinea pig product. This is a tried and true product that's going to give you amazing results. You just got to try it because just think how much time could pass if you just put it aside and don't try it. You could be missing out on the best hair possible that you never had before. If you're interested, message me and click the link below or in my bio to get access to this lookbook and let me know what you think. Appreciate you watching. Thanks for taking the time to take a look at this and I hope to hear from you soon.